Have you gone for a walk lately? Have you ever thought about what it actually takes to walk? Most of us would think that a walk begins with one step. But when you actually stop to think about it, when we walk, a walk begins with two steps that are just repeated over and over again. Another thing to consider while we're walking is our pace, how slow or how fast we walk. You could take into consideration your breathing. Maybe you have a breathing pattern. Essentially, however, walking is a simple act. It's something that we do every single day that we really don't think about much. Who would have thought that a simple act like walking could actually connect us to God a lot more than we'd ever stop to think about? Having quite the active mind, I remember I used to love walking and for one reason and that was to speak to God. I'd walked up to an hour each day and as I'd walk, I'd have a conversation with God, speaking to Him as I would to a friend. I'd offload all my worries, concerns and cares, the highs and lows of life. I would speak to Him and I'd share everything with Him. When I think about walking with God or people who walk to God, a few names come to mind. Enoch, Noah and Abraham. They all had amazing relationships with Jesus and they all walked with God. So why walk with God? Well, we were never promised that life on earth would be easy. And I'm sure by now, as we've all figured out, it certainly is not. Walking with God doesn't necessarily mean that going through the things that we go through will make them easier, but it definitely means that they will become a lot more possible. When we have God by our sides, His presence gives us assurance and the strength to make it through the toughest of times, and He gives us the power to live out our lives. At the beginning of this video, I mentioned pace, how slow or how fast we walk. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I am not a fast walker. I take my time, take in my surroundings, and I quite love a good old stroll. The same can be said about our relationship with God and walking with Him. When we walk with God, we're not rushed. God meets us where we're at. He comes alongside us at the pace that we set with Him. He walks with us and as we walk with God, we learn to be patient with Him and we learn to trust Him as He guides our steps. Talking about God meeting us where we're at, there's an awesome verse in Leviticus chapter 26, verse 12, and it says this, I will also walk among you and be your God and you shall be my people. I absolutely love that. Talk about a God who's right there beside us. He's not ahead of us and we don't have to chase him and he's not behind us that we have to turn back and find out where he is. He's right there by our sides among us and amongst it. I challenge you guys today as I challenge myself. Have a little walk with Jesus. Literally go for a walk and pay attention to your feet and be reminded of what it means to walk with God. Have a mad chat with Jesus. Tell him everything that's going on in your life and trust that he's right beside you. He walks slowly with you through the valleys and supports you as your number one hype man up on the mountaintops. That was awesome. You know what else is awesome? Some of our YouTube content. Make sure you hit like, subscribe, get the bell on and check out some of these videos.